In a Moodle course, it can be helpful to do some actions in bulk. And one of the ways to do that is with the mass actions block. If we take a look at this example course and turn editing on, each of the activities and resources now have a checkbox next to them. That's because the mass actions block is turned on for this course. If I open the block drawer, here I can see that mass actions block that allows me to do things like select all of something in a course or all of something in a section and then complete specific actions like show, hide, duplicate, etc. Delete can be really powerful, but also something to be very cautious about so that you don't accidentally delete large portions of your course. In this example, in the major assignments section, I've put all of these in as an instructor, but I don't want students to see them at the beginning of the semester. So I'm going to select all in sections and choose major assignments. Now every single one is selected and I'm going to select hide. Once that has been completed, I can scroll down and see that each of these assignments has now been hidden for, from students. Then when I'm ready to reveal them, I can use, instead of the mass actions block, just the individual tools to make those ready for students to be able to see. Let's go over how to add a block and specifically the mass actions block. In a course, open the block drawer. Once the block drawer is open, select add a block. Choose the mass actions block. The block will be added at the bottom of all existing blocks. Once the block is activated, as soon as you have edit mode on, you will see the available checkboxes and you can either check boxes manually and then complete actions for each of the selected boxes, or you can select all in specific sections in order to complete the different actions. Hopefully the mass actions block will make certain parts of your semester a little bit more efficient.